welcome back to our channel today we are going to be talking about snapback okay guys to our new subscribers you guys are all welcome thank you guys for subscribing continue to share our videos like and comment we need your opinions and thoughts on everything we post here so guys today we are going to be talking about how I lost my post pattern weight so after having Jamed I had no idea about what I was going to do as far as my fitness goals on if I was going to you know get on a strict plan to lose weight and exercise all of that stuff but things started hitting okay first you know I started I said I was going to you know get in the gym and you know get my body right but COVID started Bruh. I didn't have that chance to go to the gym and you know we ended up building our own gym at home and I decided to just start working out you know little by little figuring things out that worked for me and so I just kept doing that my workout routine about 30 minutes each day and this was about a month after I had Jamed, so I had time to heal and all of that so I've been working out since then and for some reason I guess people were seeing results to me I wasn't really seeing the results or drastic results that I wanted but people were seeing that and I started getting a lot of questions on what exactly I was doing and so I decided to film everything for you guys on you know my exercise FYI guys I am NOT a fitness coach or a trainer these are just exercises that um I decided to you know start or be doing because they were easier to do at home and to me I feel like other moms um you know or especially new moms at home you know that tend to be at home with their kids they can do this too you know when your baby's sleeping you know you can do this workout so please guys, I am not perfect nor a coach, so yeah. Another thing guys, this workouts can all be done in the indoors or in your at the comfort of your home. I decided to just film it outdoors so you guys can clearly see everything and each workout how it's done. Alright guys, enough talking. Um now I'm going to walk you guys through each exercise. So let's jump into the video. Alright guys, so to begin your workout, you're going to have to start by stretching, you know, just flexing your muscles. You don't want to get injured while, you know, doing your workout, so just go ahead and stretch. Next, you're going to um, begin with your favorite cardio workout. For me, I like to do the jump ropes instead of running, just because I don't have enough time to go out and run. So you can do your jump ropes while you're indoors. As a beginner, you might want to do this at your own pace. Do what you can handle. For me, I like to do this 10 to 15 minutes or up to 20. And I begin my workout by working on my lower body. And I do 3 sets of 10 reps of squatting. Guys, you can do this with weights or without weights. Over the time, I have just increased my weights. I started it without any weights. So it's your choice to do it with or without weights. My next lower body workout is lounges. I continue um, doing so by doing three sets of 10 reps again. And guys, I repeat, you can do this with or without weights. I begin by doing mine without it and over the time, I just add my weights. And you can start as low as using a five pounds dumbbell and move it up to a weight that you can handle. If you can do 30, go ahead and do so, but don't go overboard where you get too tired and you can't complete the workout. Next, I am doing bicycle. This is tough or can be tough because you have to keep your legs nice and straight and sturdy. The more you do the correct workout the better for you it's better to do that than doing a bunch of workouts that don't make any sense the next set of workouts I'm, I'm doing is mountain climbers again I am doing three sets of 10 reps at a nice and sturdy pace that I can handle 
Remember, pace yourself, take a break, drink some water, not too much, and just, you know, keep up with the workout. Now we are going to target the FUPA, the, the, the lower belly fat. Most women struggle with this, especially after birth, but this workout is leg extension, and with a proper diet, you should be able to see a greater result. Yeah, I'm just taking a little break, sipping my water, you know, just to catch myself and catch a breather before I go on to the next workout. Another great lower belly workout that I do is sit-ups. Remember to use a proper technique by keeping your chin facing up so you don't hurt your back and your neck. As you can see guys, I have the weights on my feet to hold me down. Normally I do this with my husband when he's around, but when he's away or when I'm home alone doing my workouts, this is what I normally do to keep me down. Another great workout that's great for stubborn lower belly fat is a seated leg crunch. Um, and I do the three sets of 10 reps. And normally sometimes I try to go a little bit more just because, you know, the fat down there, they don't want to leave. So I just push and do the best I can. Next, I am just doing my leg raises. Another great ab workout. Stick with me guys, we're coming to an end for our workout. And I do three sets of 10 reps for this workout. To wrap up this video, I am just going to plank for 35 to 45 seconds. If you can plank a lot more or greater than that amount, great. Go ahead and do that. Guys, all of this would not work without a proper diet. So go ahead and you know try to eat clean and do all of this and you should have a great result also stay consistent don't give up every day is a day to make a change so do the best that you can and give it your all hope you guys enjoyed that video Feel free to comment down below what are some of your favorite at-home workouts. I would love to hear it all. Also, you guys can DM me directly to my Instagram or Facebook. Or same on here. Send us an email and, you know, I'm here to answer all of your questions or anything that I missed that I didn't cover for you guys. Remember, you have to start from somewhere. You know, we all I know we all make excuses and all of that stuff. But sometimes, you know, you just have to get up and start. Just, just go for it. Just do it. You know, believe and trust in yourself. I didn't, you know, I had a lot of self-doubt about, you know, doing these workouts or just getting up and starting and, you know, doing something about it. But one day I just told myself I can do it. Not even because somebody else, is, somebody else did it, but I just, you know, had that belief in myself that I can do it. So, you know, how about you take this chance and do the same? Before you guys go, if you have not subscribed, go ahead and do that now. Like and, you know, share this video with your loved ones or, you know, with your friends. And well, anybody that is struggling with postpartum weight, I know it's not easy, you know, after just having a baby. A lot goes through, your, you know, goes on, you know, in your body and all of that. And things like this could be a little bit challenging. I had some challenges doing this workout or starting this workout. I realized that things were not the same or working out was not the same anymore. So I could understand, but you guys take your time. Remember consistency is the key. If you want to see your results, stay on top of your workout, you know, push yourself. You are, be your own motivation, you guys. Don't forget to turn on your notification buttons. I have more lovely contents coming for you guys you know down the road i'll be talking about my daily diet on what i consume or you know what my diet is like i'll see you guys on the next video